Okay, now we have the receiver configured, so we just need to uh, do some settings on the radio itself. Basically, we need to have channels 1 through 4, aileron, elevator, throttle, rudder, as is the default configuration. And we're going to set channels 9, 10, and 12 to be the gain, the flight mode select, and the self-test mode. In addition, we're going to set a value so that we can hear what the gain is. So let's go ahead and do that. Pick the plane. Page over to Mixer. Okay, there's our AETR as per the default setup. We come down to channel 9. Source. We're going to pick S1 by moving that. And we're going to set the weight to 50 and we're going to set the offset to 50 and this will basically mean that the full range of the of the of turning the dial will get us between 0 there's 50 and there's 100% Okay, next we need to set channel 10. That'll be the flight mode. Just select the source and flip uh, switch C. That's all we need to do to set that. And let's, uh, we can skip channel 11. And we go to channel 12. And that's going to be switch D. So here we have the three things we've needed to do specially. And now let's page over to the special function menu. And let us pick switch A down. And we'll pick that as play value. And we're going to play channel 9, which is the game that we've set. And let's set that, oh, like uh, every 5 seconds. So basically, 50. as we can, you'll see I'm going to move 9. And if we switch it all the way up. 100. And so basically you'll be able to use that while you fly to find 34. out what uh, the, the proper value is. So with the mixes and this, uh, let's get rid of that, and this uh, audio, now we're all set up for the next step, which is a bench self-test.